Alright guys, my apologies for not uh, posting any videos in the last little bit. Um, I think you saw, might have saw the recent one, the update, uh, maybe last week when I did it, that uh, had a bit of a case change at the last minute. My better half decided to get me this in replace, uh, replacing the uh, Zygmatech Elysium. So I uh, had a few family affairs to attend to in the last weekend, so I really couldn't do any work, but uh, just getting things up and running now. So I thought I'd do a quick little shot of where I'm at right now and what my thoughts are on this one. This is the Case Labs TH10 case. As you can see, it is huge. It holds uh, any number of fans, radiators, like it's just massive. But, uh, oh well, not any number. Specifically, this one is um, designed to hold 480 rads. And uh, I got a bunch in there. So the, uh, you can see the case is white. The blue on the side here is just um, plastic wrap over the, uh, the plexi. Just haven't removed it yet. I don't want to get it damaged. Uh, the front of the case looks some, look, well, looks like that. Um, on the uh, right hand side there, I've got uh, four fans uh, that are in, are in front of the uh, hard drive bays, which I'll show you in a minute. And on the left hand side is, the, uh, is all the uh, five and a quarter inch bays, etc. Uh, the two white with black screens are actually the uh, Lamptron touches. Uh, I've painted them white and actually the white's not very white so I'm gonna have to redo that. But in any event I didn't want to have a bunch of black devices on this white case so I've been, um, been sort of painting away. And that one empty slot below there I'm waiting for a USB 3 and uh, SD card reader combination to come and that's what's gonna go in there and I'm gonna make sure that's white too so we kinda keep it consistent looking on the front. Um, the case itself is all aluminum. It's a very large case. You need to make sure it either fits under your desk or you have an appropriate size room to fit this in. Um, it's going to sit uh, uh, next to my desk because it won't sit under. I've put the, uh, the casters on the bottom uh, for my purposes, basically because uh, my radiators that are going to sit along the bottom and the top and the bottom ones are going to actually be intakes. So I need some space in there in order to get the, uh, the air flowing. This is just the back of the case. Uh, I think I talked about it before, dual power supplies, uh, fits the SR2. There's 10 slots back there for the PCIs. Um, and uh, yeah, it's a beautiful case. Let's take a quick look inside, show you what I've been up to when I said I've been painting things up. Uh, those are the four, two 480 rads with the uh, Zygmatech crystal blue fan. So those will be uh, LEDs, LEDs and blued. And then inside the case, again, um, Basically, I'm going with uh, a 360 at the bottom and a 480 at the top, and you'll see that I've painted them white. Obviously, I did not paint the fins. If you want to take a look inside, that black part in there is obviously the, uh, the actual fins themselves. You don't really ever want to touch those with paint. Uh, it'll destroy your cooling. So everything's going to be in a push-pull configuration, as you can see. Um, there's lots of room in this case, so I'm not concerned at all about things fitting. Uh, there is going to be a, a, a dual MCP 655 pump.